Yeah. Yes. Okay, so welcome back. To baby hands. To baby hands. <laughs> After <laughs> torturing me <laughs> with, and I don't know how much of it got out. I don't know what Sarah split up. I don't know what she showed. Yeah. Not, we'll but see. I suffered today. So, Ravi suffered a lot. I I played Emily is Away. Yep, just did this about an hour ago. And... It was the worst experience ever. For I, I, I'm not the same man anymore <laughs> after what happened there. Uh, but this game's amazing. Yes. Um, Sarah and I both are, are huge fans of the Phoenix Wright series. Yes. And so we're going to play the little tutorial and uh, hope that I enjoy. And, you know, if it's fun enough, maybe it makes it up on the channel. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. All right. Tell us what you guys think. Yeah, tell us what you guys think about the Phoenix Wright series and doing a, a tiny play or a, even just a, some of the cases. Or yeah. However you want to do it. All right. So, like all good games, it starts off violently. <laughs> um... <laughs> Man, Phoenix Wright, what a series. Right? What, so much to say. There's so much to say. I introduced it to Robbie. Wow. Funny enough. I'm interested to see how this will turn out because, man, the low resolution that we're getting here is incredible. So bad. I know. But hey, it's, but hey, it's, 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 it's readable. It is readable. It is very legible. I mean, yeah. this is how it looked on the on the DS. Yeah, that's true. It wasn't quite as big, but... Yeah. All right. I guess you'll be Phoenix and I'll be Mia. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's true. Yeah, we gotta read. <clears throat> gotta get I don't your... know. I feel like I'm more of a Mia. <laughs> I think that, yeah, don't you, I mean, don't you think you're a bit of a phoenix? I should, uh, I is that like. because, is that just so you'll voice at Miles when it comes up? No, of course not. I'm, I don't, I You have can't. to be Winston. As, oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'll yes. let, no, 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 I'll be, it, I'll, do you want me to judge and I'll be Winston? Absolutely. Okay, okay, Absolutely. got this, got this. So wait, am I mirror or phoenix? Which one do you want to be? I mean, it's up to you. Uh, I think for this one, I'm going to be Mia. All right, I'll be phoenix. <laughs> all right. <clears throat> Boy, am I nervous. Right. <laughs> oh, oh hiya, Chief. Ooh, I'm glad I made it on time. <laughs> oh my gosh, Robbie. <laughs> That's funny. Well, I have to say, Phoenix, <laughs> I'm impressed. <laughs> Not everyone takes on a murder <laughs> trial right off the bat like this. Let me give you my sassy stare. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. <laughs> it says a lot about you and your client <laughs> as well. Uh, thanks. Actually, it's because I owe him a favor. A sexual favor, <laughs> Phoenix? It's not, not like that, boss. A favor? <laughs> my god, my chesticles are so <laughs> scrumptious I couldn't focus on you for a second. You mean you knew the defendant before this case? Now, don't you thinking? <laughs> Wouldn't this have come up in the pre-trial? <laughs> Wouldn't this have come up when we were prepping for the case? No. Wouldn't this have come up... Isn't that an immediate conflict of interest? <laughs> no. Not at all. This, no, this not. is Phoenix Wright. <laughs> Let's go to the court record. Oh my god. <laughs> no one would believe you're a defense attorney. Here is the entire autopsy report. <laughs> it has the time, time and date death, of death. The cause of death. And that's it. And that's it. They used to have more details. <laughs> they will in the future. <laughs> yes. Actually, I kind of owe my current job to him. He's one of the reasons I became an attorney. Well, that's news to me. Especially since they retconned that in Game 3. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I want to help him out any way I can. Phoenix, is this really your motivation? <laughs> yes, it's really. I feel like your motivation is grape juice. <laughs> I just really want to help him. I owe him that much. Do you want to be... Oh, yeah. It's over! My life! Everything! It's all over! Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Isn't that your client screaming over there? Who would also be my client as I am your senior partner? <laughs> yeah, that's him. Death! Despair! Ooh! I'm gonna do it! I'm gonna die! It sounds like he wants to die. <laughs> That's my expert investigative skills. Um, yeah. <sighs> Nick! <laughs> hey, hey there, Larry. Dude, I'm so guilty. <laughs> Tell them I'm guilty. <laughs> 
give me a death sentence. I ain't afraid to die. <laughs> what? What's wrong, Larry? Oh, it's all over. I, I'm finished. Finished? I can't live in a world without her. I can't. What are you, cheese reaper? <laughs> Who? Who took her away from me, Nick? Who did this? Oh, Nick, you gotta tell me. Who took my baby away? <laughs> this is... This is Larry Bucks. Bucks. <laughs> I'd like to know that this is the only time he is referred to as a likable guy. That's true. He's never thought of that ever again. That's correct. Also, Cindy, Cindy Stone, Stone, who was beaten to, to death. death by a stone figure. <laughs> <laughs> Never let it be said that they were insensitive. <laughs> I know, exactly. Who took my baby away? Hmm, a person responsible for your girlfriend's death? <laughs> that was not how I thought that sentence. <laughs> Newspapers say it was you. My name is Phoenix Wright. <laughs> I'm an ace, ace attorney. attorney. That's, uh, that's uh, Brental Floss. That's Brental Floss. Fantastic. Yeah, we'll put the anyway. link. Put the yeah, link in the description. we'll put the link there. Take a look at it. <laughs> <clears throat> anyway. Here's the story. <laughs> My first case is a fairly simple one. Why are you from Texas? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know my voice. My first case is a... Uh, no, that is his voice now. <laughs> is that his he, voice now? He is, yes. It's Texas? That's okay, okay. All right. I'll see if I can still keep it up. Oh, you can't. A young woman was killed in her apartment. Yeah! The guy they arrested was the unlucky sad dating her. Larry Butts. My best friend since grade school. Our school had a saying, when something smells, it's usually the butts. Now, I'd like to note that Phoenix and him were friends, it turns out, in elementary school. <laughs> yep. Which, this is pretty witty. <laughs> For some elementary it school is. kids, I gotta say. It really is. But also very appropriate. <laughs> yeah. In the 23 years I've known him, it's usually been true. I'm pretty sure I'm only 23 years old. Right. Yeah. Well, okay. he's 23 years old. Wait! <laughs> you know, I didn't know they knew each other since birth. <laughs> he came out the womb knowing this motherfucker? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm literally learning. I just replayed all these games. <laughs> I, know, I just replayed oh every gosh. single one. He has a knack for getting himself in Except trouble. Except for Apollo Justice, because nobody cares. Oh, Robbie. <laughs> one thing I can say, though, it's usually not his fault. He just has terrible luck. I'd like to note that this is the only... I, again, I've recently played This is the only time they suggest that this is... It's not Larry's fault. Yeah. Every other every time, time, they're like, he, he sucks. sucks. <laughs> <laughs> but I know better than anyone, he's a good guy at heart. That and I own one. That's why I took the case to clear his name. And that's just what I'm gonna do. <laughs> this axe is so bad. <laughs> <laughs> You're nailing it. <laughs> August 3rd, 10 a.m. District Court. Courtroom number two. Oh, Get these voices! <laughs> wow. That is degraded sound. Right. The court is now in session for the trial of Mr. Larry Butts. The prosecution is ready, Your Honor. The uh, defense is ready, Your Honor. <clears throat> Mr. Wright, <laughs> this is your first trial, is it not? Because that's uh, how this works. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, Your Honor. I'm uh, a little nervous. <laughs> your conduct during this trial will decide the fate of your client. In case you are not aware of your role. <laughs> You are a lawyer. Oh, am I, is that where I am, yes, sir? That's my, correct. Okay. That's why you stand on the defense oh, side. Oh, oh, Put a big okay. D on the back. Uh, oh, I see it now, sir. I see for, it. For defense. F defense attorney. Am I defense attorney? Murder someone? is a serious <laughs> charge. You may not be aware. <laughs> for your client's sake, I hope you can control your nerves. Of course, sir. Th thank you, Anna. Uh, that's not something I'd thank me for. I know. I just... I'm implying that you suck. I know. I... I just... Mm. Mm. <laughs> My blinky eyes say all they need to. <laughs> Mr. Wright, given the circumstances, I think we should have a test to ascertain your readiness. Is this a good idea, sir? Maybe if you have to do that, you should just replace me? No, no. The bar exam, you would think, would do that. But it does not. It does not. Yes, Your Honor. No. Hand shaking. Eyesight fading. 
The test will consist of a few simple questions. Answer them clearly and concisely. Please state the name of the defendant in this case. Mm, I think I think that'd be Larry Butts, sir. The defendant? Well, that's Larry Butts, Your Honor. Mm, correct. <laughs> I'm glad you know that, <laughs> because he was just in the other room with you, and you introduced him <laughs> to your senior partner. I also may have forgotten what defendant is, sir. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Now, you may know that this is the most competent I will ever be <laughs> in this series. I know this, Your Honor. Great. Just keep your wits about you, and you'll do fine. Next question. This is a murder trial. Tell me, what's the victim's name? Oh, no, sir. She had a very unforgettable name. Whew, I know this one. Glad I read the case report cover to cover so many times. It has literally one page. I know. Cover to cover. Oh. <laughs> it's, wait, uh-oh. No, no way, I forgot. I tried to total blank here. Phoenix. <laughs> Are you absolutely sure? <laughs> Look at her face. <laughs> I know. Are you absolutely sure you're up to this? You don't even know the victim's name. Don't say that so loud, Lamia. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Have you, look at these things. Also, how did you know my thoughts? They were in blue. That means I was thinking. I'd say that loud. I can read minds. Oh, man. It's a gift. Oh, jeez. I don't know what this... I don't know what this position is. She never uses this She never again. uses it ever again. Oh, the victim. Of course I know the victim's name. I, uh, just forgot temporarily. What accent do you think you're doing? I don't know. <laughs> Can I not do an accent anymore? Cause I'm no, failing. you you better keep going. I can't. You better get better at it as oh, you go. Oh gosh. I think I feel a migraine <laughs> coming on. That's right. I can't be. Cons I can't remember what Mia's voice is this one. Look, the defendant's name is listed in the court record. What's that, ma'am? Just touch the court record button to check it at any time, okay? That's really so that's Remember right. to check it off and do it for me, please. <laughs> I'm begging you. Is this a game? <laughs> Let's well, hear your answer. Who is the victim in this case? Oh, man. I don't think it was Cinderblock, sir, but it sounds real close. I'm gonna guess it's Cindy Stone, sir. Cinderblock it is. <laughs> um, victim's name is Cindy Stone. Can't do it. That's correct. Now tell me, what was the cause of death? Could it have possibly been... Love? <laughs> she was uh, hit with a blunt object, sir. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. She was struck once by a blown object. Can't do it. Listen, me. we're workshopping these. I can't do this. Fine, <laughs> right, do a different voice. Then. Okay, okay. Correct. You've answered all of my questions. I see no reason why we shouldn't proceed, besides the fact that in the first place, I didn't think you'd know. <laughs> Which might be reason enough. You seem much more relaxed, Mr. Wright. Good for you. <laughs> I got a different accent now. <laughs> Thank you, Your Honor, because I don't feel relaxed, that's for sure. That... That was the best... What... It's like, it's like an annoying protagonist. It's like Sonic the Hedgehog. I know! Right. Look, you see his hair? Well then... <laughs> Fair enough. First, a question for the prosecution. Mr. Payne. Yes, his name is Winston Payne. Is he Winston? Yes, Your Honor! As Mr. Wright just told us, the victim was struck with a blunt object. Do you like to get high? <laughs> That's later. <laughs> That's later. Would you explain to the court what that object, in quotes, which is unnecessary, <laughs> was? Murder Whip was this statue of the thinker. It was found lying on the floor next to the victim. I see. The court accepts it into evidence, which it should have already done. Statue added to the court record. Right. Be sure to pay attention to any evidence added during the trial. <laughs> Why are you sounding like the one character from that, Monsters, Inc.? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I, that's what she Always is Always watching that's, with your RC. That's literally who she is now. <laughs> that is who she is now. Um. That evidence is only ammunition you have in court. <laughs> Touch the court record button to check the court record very frequently. Oh, boy. Mr. Payne, the prosecution may call its first witness. The prosecution calls the defendant Mr. Butts to the stand. Wait, what? <laughs> Isn't that really Mr. Butts? I did, sir. That is hilarious. <laughs> Butts. Uh, Chief, what do I do now? Pay attention. 
You don't want to miss any information that might help your client's case. Thankfully, <laughs> it's a text-based game and we go one screen at a time. <laughs> You'll get your chance to respond to the prosecution ladies, so be ready. You should know that. I, I forgot. Oh, God. <laughs> Let's just hope he doesn't say anything unfortunate, which I, I'm going to tell you something right now. He's going to fucking he's, say he's something. He's going to say, I, I got bad news for you. Uh-oh. Larry gets excited easily. It's going to be bad. Wow, what a shit face. <laughs> I know, right? Mr. Butts, isn't that true the victim had recently dumped you? Hey, watch it, buddy! We were great together. We were Romeo and Juliet. Cleopatra. Oh, no, no, he's Snagglepuss. <laughs> Cleopatra and Mark Antony. Yeah, I haven't picked any voices for these bit. Fuck, if, listen. <laughs> if we go on, I'll write a list of them. So I know, we you're right. That's what I have to do. Um. Didn't they all die? <laughs> I wasn't dumb. She just was taking my phone. I wasn't taking my phone calls. Who's seeing me? <laughs> Ever. <laughs> What's it to you anyway, huh? You wise guy. <laughs> wise You're not guy. so wise. <laughs> no, good fellas. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's good fellas. <laughs> Mr. Butts, what you describe is generally what we mean by dumped. In fact, she completely abandoned you and was seeing other men. Oh my god, no. She had just returned with them overseas with one of yeah, She just returned from overseas with one of them the day before the murder. I'm constantly constipated. <laughs> what do you mean, one of them? <laughs> How many of these handsome hunks were there? <laughs> lies, all of it lies. I don't believe it. What is happening to my face? <laughs> I don't know, you're blushing. I, I feel the strange Mario pills <laughs> on my face. Your Honor, the victim's passport. That is... Not an American passport. <laughs> oh, wait, yes, it is. Yes, it's, it's, it's a That's very cool. American. According to this, she was in Paris till the day before she died. Passport added to the court record. No, indeed, she appears to have returned the day before the murder. Dude, no way. The victim was a model, but did not have a large income. It appears that she had several, uh, sugar daddies. Sh thank you for that <laughs> incredibly technical term, <laughs> Mr. Payne. Always happy to help. D daddies Sugar? <laughs> mm, I think I'm getting a bit of a sweet tooth. <laughs> yes, older men who gave her money and gifts. Yeah, I have to say, this is... <laughs> Very fucked up. <laughs> How old is this woman? She's 22! Okay. You're not that weird. No, that's pretty weird. <laughs> I mean, sugar daddies are weird to begin with. <laughs> yeah, I guess it wouldn't. I guess the age would be the issue. She took their money and used to support her lifestyle. He's clearly judging her. I know. Clearly. Yeah, but she wouldn't take my money, that yeah. whore. <laughs> like, jeez. <laughs> Dude! <laughs> we can clearly see what kind of woman this Miss Stone is. Jeez! Alright, Mr. Slut Shame. <laughs> right? Holy fuck. Tell me, Mr. Butts, what do you think of her now? Right? I don't think you want him to answer that question. <laughs> yeah, Larry has a way of running his mouth in all the wrong directions. Should I stop him from answering? Boom! My client had no idea the victim was seeing other men. <clears throat> that question is irrelevant to this case. <clears throat> Oof! Wins like my name! <laughs> Dude, Nick, what do you mean irrelevant? <laughs> That cheating she dog. I I can't say bitch. So. <laughs> I'm gonna die. I'm just gonna drop dead. That's not much of a threat, actually. Not really. I'll see uh, some like stamp right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. I'm gonna get to the bottom of this when I see it, cause I'm dead. That's what I'm saying. It's not actually a very big threat. To be honest. <laughs> Let's continue with the trial, shall we? Also, I'd like to note that Mr. Phoenix Wright's interruption is the only time he's ever gonna do that. When that. he says, oh, it's not relevant to the case, yeah. that line of questioning. He's never going to do that again. He's never going to do that ever again. <laughs> I believe the accused motive is clear to everyone. It's not. No, oh, oh boy. This is not looking good. This is so sad. not looking good. <laughs> <laughs> Next question. You went to the victim's apartment on the day of the murder, did you not? Oh, gulp me. <laughs> well, did you or did you not? Heh, <laughs> heh. Well, maybe I did and maybe I didn't, Mr. Man. 
You're gonna have to ask me better than that. Uh-oh, he went. What do I do? Um, how... Does it really matter? Have him answer honestly. Sarah, you're acting like the choices in this game are irrelevant. I know. <laughs> I know. I'll send him a signal. Tell the truth. <laughs> it's not a good signal. <laughs> Uh, oh, okay, yeah, it was there, I went. I can't, what is wrong with this face? <laughs> I know, I don't know, something's twitching. Got it, okay. <laughs> Order! Oh, whoops. <laughs> well, Mr. Butch, dude, chill! She wasn't home, man, I, so, like, I couldn't kill her. Oh, <laughs> I see her, I see her. Objection! Your Honor, the defendant is lying. Lying? <laughs> On what? <laughs> On a bench, or the prosecution would like to call a witness who can prove Mr. Butts is lying. Why didn't we start with that? Because I like to make things complicated. That is the way of the prosecution. But every other time we're going to call the witness first, we will never do this You're again. You're right. I, I'm the prosecution. You take orders from me now. That's how it works, right? Well, that is that is how that works. Thank actually. you. Thank that you. That is how pretty much how we do it. Well, that simplifies matters. Who is your witness? <laughs> the man who found the victim's body. Just before making a gruesome discovery. Well, I'm very interested to see this normal ma named man. Yeah. Who is this man with an extremely average, <laughs> unironic, non-punny name? He saw the defendant fleeing the scene of the crap. Could someone please... What is that in the background? <laughs> order. Order in the court. I'll tell you. Order in a, a dunk. Duncan Payne. All right. <laughs> Mr. Payne, the prosecution may call its witness. Yes, Your Honor. Mrs. Bad. On the day of the murder, my witness was selling newspapers to the victim's building. Please bring Mr. Frank Sot to the sand. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> I am, Your Honor. <laughs> Are you for real? Holy <laughs> shit, this guy's <laughs> evil. All right. Mr. Sot, you sell newspaper subscriptions. Is this correct? No! Nobody reads those! There's oh, no geez. way he could afford a suit! Oh. <laughs> okay, the problem is that it's obviously calling for a really racist Indian accent. <laughs> I'm aware of what it's asking for, Sarah. <laughs> but we can't go fucking Sim Sim Salabim on this shit. Alright? <laughs> Are we gonna do this? Thank you, newspaper again. <laughs> you can't do it, alright? <laughs> It's not appropriate. How do you know how mad people are gonna get if I was like, oh, oh yes, newspapers, yes. You have any? I mean, they would the be worst. enraged, especially if right after that, it was, Mr. Shaw, you may proceed with your testimony. <laughs> you just can't. It's not gonna work. Please tell the court what you saw on the day of the murder. Wow, woof, wow, witness account. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I'll tell you what you can't do. You can't go, I was going door to door selling a subscription. <laughs> you can't say that. That's <laughs> fucked up. When I saw it, Eddie, listen, the point is, it's extremely racist. Uh, I'm trying to so, uh, yeah, just be Mr. Sot. Hmm. I mean, I've got one, but I've done a lot of it. You, uh, you can do it then. I was going door to door selling subscriptions when I saw a man fleeing an apartment. I thought he must be in a hurry because he left the door half open behind him. <laughs> Thinking it's strange, I looked inside the apartment. It, you know, the apartment, apartment. <laughs> then I saw her lying there, a woman, not moving. Dead, probably. <laughs> I quailed in fright and found myself unable to go inside. I thought to call the police immediately. However, the phone in her apartment wasn't wor- Oh, no, I'm slipping the other one. <laughs> wasn't working. Now I'm just doing me as well. I went to a nearby park and found a public phone. I remember the time exactly. It was 1 p.m. You look like an Igor voice. Igor? <laughs> Master. <laughs> the man who was, without a doubt, the defendant sitting right over there. <laughs> Perfect. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Mm. <laughs> Larry, why didn't you tell the truth? I can't defend you against a testimony like that. Incidentally, why wasn't the phone in the victim's apartment working? Because I'm a very judgmental man. Your Honor, at the time of the murder, there was a blackout in the building. What? Aren't phones <laughs> supposed to work during a blackout? <laughs> yes, Your Honor. Right. However, some cordless phones not function normally. 
A court what is this? <laughs> New technology. The phone that Mr. Sart used was one of those. Oh, I see it in this picture here that we've been given. I don't understand why we have this. <laughs> it's our imaginations. Why are we... Are we psychic? Yes, Your Honor. That's amazing. Your Honor. I have a record of the blackout for your perusal. Oh, fantastic. Everyone knows those blackout the records. Blackout record, edge of the court record. A record in a record, it's recordception. <laughs> and now, uh, Mr. Wright. Yes, er, yes, Your Honor. <clears throat> you may begin your cross-examination. Oh, crap. Cross-examination, Your Honor. <laughs> All right, right. <laughs> <laughs> this is it, the real deal. Uh, what exactly am I supposed to do? Why, you expose the lies in the testimony the witness just gave. What if happens if he didn't tell a lie? We got nothing. <laughs> we lose. <laughs> we lose. Lies? What? He was lying. On the bench, Mr. Wright. Your client is innocent, <laughs> right? Then the witness must have lied in his testimony. No, we are not going for a plea bargain. That is not here. <laughs> nope. Or is <laughs> your client really guilty? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's so close. How do I prove he's not? All right, are you fucking serious? <laughs> <laughs> what do I do? I don't want to do it. All this education I was in lawyer school for. Right, just went out the window. Didn't you go to art school? Shh, we don't know that till game three. Oh, fair enough. You hold the key. What it's key? The, uh, the, no, in not my a, house keys? No, not a literal. No, that the literal keys don't come till later evidence. Oh, oh, sorry. This is a figurative key. Got it, got it. A court record-like key. Oh, okay. Look at all these <laughs> options you have. Oh, man, oh, man. Do not present this. Really? It will not help. Oh. <clears throat> the evidence. Compare the witness's <clears throat> testimony to the evidence at hand. There's bound to be a contradiction in there. That's a big word. All right, right, jeez. First, find contradictions between the court record and the witness's testimony. Then once you've found the contradicting evidence, present... <laughs> present it and rub it in his face. Uh, um, okay. Touch the court record button and point out the contradictions in the testimony. I think I got it. Okay, good. You just listen to me for once. Cool, cool. Got this, I got this. I don't think there's anything special here. Move on. All right, fair enough. Uh, move on. Oh, great. Move on. All right. Uh, move She's on. She's not dead. Dog show. I don't think Aquila was right. Okay. This oh, is this. actually way longer than I remember. Than I, remember. I know. Right? Holy shit. Jesus. Oh my oh god. <laughs> there we go. Present. Present. What should we present, Mr. Um, Man? um, look, look at the, 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 the yeah, that, that. Now, yeah. wait a second. This, this is a four and that's, and that's a, a one. one. We got to present that. Yeah. <laughs> you forgot that the game says that for you? No, yeah, I did. <laughs> you found the body at 1 p.m., you sure? Yeah. Uh, yes. Yes, it was 1 p.m. for certain. Wait, am I Igor? That's right. Igor, yeah. It was 1 p.m. for certain. Frankly, I find that hard to believe, Mr. Frank. Oh, so I, I get it. <laughs> Your statement directly contradicts the autopsy report. What are you, why, why are you tapping it like that? I want to make enunciate my, my point. Oh. The autopsy notes the time of death sometime after 4 p.m. There is nobody to, uh, no body to find at 1 p.m. How do you explain this three-hour gap? <laughs> well, I, well I, I don't know how... That's a uh, hoo ha hoo hoo hoo. This is trivial! The witness merely forgot the time! <clears throat> I don't think so. After his testimony, I find that hard to believe. And you're going to find that I find most things hard to believe. <laughs> Particularly facts. <laughs> Mr. Sart. Oh, I see. <laughs> I get it now. <laughs> Why are you so certain that you found the body at one? <laughs> Well, I, well, I, uh, gee, that's a really good question. Great job, right? Way to put him on the spot. That's all you have to do. Point out contradictions. Sounds simple, right? Yeah. No, they're not going to make sense. No, no, they're not going to make sense in the future. Lies always beget more lies. That's what the Bible told me. <laughs> 
see through one and their whole story falls apart. Oh my. Or they just make shit up as they go. Yeah, either way. <laughs> Wait, I remember now. <laughs> Would you care to give your testimony again? Yeah, you can just do that. <laughs> you can just do that here. You know, we can just do it how many times yeah. you want. We, we, yeah, perjury doesn't exist. Per well, I'll, I'll scold you for it. That's about it. Yep. <laughs> I've never held anyone in contempt of court. My, my favorite thing is there was, I saw somewhere online where that those, like, just those, um, descriptions or whatever, they had, they, they made one up and they put in front of Larry and they said, the total truth, I swear I'm not lying this time, what really happened, <laughs> number two. <laughs> yeah. That is... <laughs> God, that's true. God, that's true. <clears throat> you see, when I found the body, I heard the time. There was a vo- Oh no, it's Igor. There was a voice saying the time. It was probably coming from the television. Oh, but it was three hours off, wasn't it? I guess the victim must have been watching a video of a taped program. That's why I thought it was one. Terribly sorry about the misunderstanding. Now, if it sounds like he pulled that out of his ass... He did. It's because not only did he, but he's allowed to. <laughs> I see you heard a voice saying the time on the taped program. Mr. Wright, you may cross-examine the witness. Right. You know what to do. I got this one. Mm. I swear I do. Uh, well, I am less than confident. <laughs> I'll show you. Okay, not that. Uh, maybe that? Uh, yeah, I think that's Yeah, probably yeah, it. but the, the slip of paper for the blackout. Objection. Yeah, that one. God, this game's easy. <laughs> Hold it right there. I hope they all make this much sense. <laughs> the prosecution has said there was a blackout at the time of the discovery. Oh, shit. And this record proves it. Where'd you get that? <laughs> Slam a disc. You couldn't have heard a television or a video. <clears throat> <laughs> Roro? <laughs> ah, yeah, well, uh. Erk. <laughs> <laughs> the defense has made a point. Do you have an explanation for this, Mr. Short? No. Uh, no, I do not. <laughs> I got nothing. <laughs> ah! Wait, I remember now. Mr. Short? The court would prefer to hear an accurate testimony <laughs> from the very beginning. I'd like to, I'd like, if you could spread that around to the ladies and gentlemen of the world. <laughs> I appreciate we it. Would, uh, this game would be much shorter. <laughs> yeah, sure. Tell you what. These constant corrections are harming your credibility. Some would say you have none. <laughs> and we all. should dismiss you as a witness. Exactly. Imagine you seem rather distraught. This is the first time I will notice this. Yeah, I there will be lightning bolts out of someone's butt, and I will not notice. It's... Yeah, I'd like to note that in the future, people's heads will literally explode. <laughs> and I will go, nah, I might be lying. Hard to tell, you know? Hard to tell. Hard to tell. But here, this guy, look at him with his shuffly hands. <laughs> my, my apologies, Your Honor. Uh, you're gonna take over Sod. I'm doing way too many voices. <laughs> it uh, must have been a shock of fighting the body. <clears throat> Very well, Mr. Shot. Let's show your testimony once more, please. Probably can't do as well as you can, but we'll try. Nah, you, you'll nail it. Actually, I didn't hear the time. I saw it. Okay, you better shut the fuck up if you say that one again. <laughs> I swear to God, if you come in here and you keep saying saw it. Anyway. There was a table clock in the apartment, wasn't there? Mm, maybe. Yeah, the murder weapon. The killer used it to hit the victim. Hold on, we have have we established a murder weapon yet? Holy what? That must have been what I saw. What? <laughs> you saw a clock. Which was a murder weapon. <laughs> the defense might cross examine, I have no questions. <laughs> Gladly. I don't know what that was. <laughs> oh well. Right. Gladly. Gladly. Get the texting. Oh, the music. Um, skip. Skip. Table clock. Um. Uh, must, okay. Oh, wait. I wonder if we have to press something. She usually. I think she tells us what we have to learn to press. Oh, you're right. Um, I think it's that. Table one. clock in the apartment. 
rather heavy. Oh wait, no, the murder weapon. That's what it is. The murder weapon. It's not a clock. It's a statue. Right, right, right. Okay. <clears throat> That's right, because he, 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 why should he know it's a clock? He, he shouldn't. <laughs> <clears throat> the murder weapon wasn't a clock, it was a statue. Look at him pooping. Now how is this supposed to be a clock? Here we go. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh no. What? Yeah. You, your objection to your evidence? Just who do you think you are? Just answer the question, Mr. Sot. Okay, seriously. Hey, I, I saw it there, no, okay? No, stop it! Saw it there! <laughs> Stop it! Uh, that, that's a clock! Y Your Honor, if I may! Yes, Mr. Payne? As the witness stated, this statue is indeed a clock! Okay, you just used two words to describe that, and I'm gonna need you to use one. <laughs> a statue or a clock? The neck is a switch, you just tilt it and says the time out loud. That is a weird clock. As it doesn't look like a clock, I submitted it as a statue. My apologies. Alright, well, how about in the future you give us all the information? How about that? How about that one? Okay, I see. So the murder weapon was a table clock after all. Well, Mr. Wright, it appears that the witness's testimony was correct. Do you have any problems with his testimony yes, now? Yes, I do, Your Honor. Oh, you're not just going to give up? All right, well. <laughs> Your Honor, there's a gaping hole in the witness's testimony. All right, well, this is getting weird. I don't... Okay. The only way he could have known the weapon was a clock is to hold it in his hand. What? Yet the witness testified that he never entered the apartment. Oh, because he'd have to he'd have to hit the switch. I, I see what you're saying. Okay, well. Clearly a contradiction. Oh, uh, thank you, Mr. Wright. God, I got it. <laughs> Indeed. The witness knew it was a clock because he... Uh, went into the apartment. <laughs> no. He knew the victim. They were just buddies. You're lying. You were inside the apartment the day of the murder. <laughs> oh yeah? Prove it. Prove I went in there. I'll do better than that. I can prove you were the one who killed her. Whoa, whoa, what, what, whoa. Uh, miss, is this going to be a thing is where you just a... randomly accuse people of murder? Yeah, apparently. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'll just, I'll just get ready for that then. You struck her with the clock and the shock of the blow triggered the clock's voice. That was the sound you heard. <laughs> okay, there is an avalanche going on outside. Somebody stop that. <laughs> Order in the court! Intriguing! Please continue! <laughs> I know it might seem odd that you randomly accused a witness of murder, but actually, I think it's hilarious. I think it's hilarious. Please keep on. Yes, Your Honor. Mr. Sot, the sound must have left quite an impression on you. Understandable, since the murder weapon spoke just as you hit the victim. That voice was burned into your mind. That's why you were so certain about the time. What's the meaning of this? This is all baseless conjecture. Baseless? Just look at the witness's face. All right, that's not the... You can't just... Whatever. All right, fine. <laughs> <laughs> well, the witness can't do elaborate. <laughs> Maybe, perhaps... <laughs> or... <laughs> 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 Did you strike the victim with the <laughs> out, of curio out of curiosity? Did Were you, you the murder? murder? Out of curiosity, Were you the murder? Did you just straight up murder that house? I, I, that day, I, I never. Look, I, the clock I heard. No, I mean I saw, saw. Okay, what did? Oh, uh, um. Oh, that was disgusting. All right, that. Shiv, 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 I hate you. Here was him. I tell you, I saw him. Okay. I saw it. Now, uh, you know what? I was gonna let it go. <laughs> He, he killed her and he she burned, burned, give him death. We do not burn people. We we hang them. <laughs> we don't burn them. Order! Order in the court, I say. Mm, mm. Your Honor, a moment, please. Oh, God. There isn't a shred of evidence supporting the defense's claim. Well, you know what? That's a good point, actually. That's kind of just out of his asshole, isn't it? Mm. Exactly. Mr. Wright. Y Your Honor? You claim the sound the witness heard came from the clock. Do you have any evidence besides the clock? <laughs> the whole life case is writing on this. I better think it through carefully. Yes, Your Honor. The sound Mr. Saw it heard was definitely this clock, and he did I'm not really see it. I'm really tired of you saying saw it heard. <laughs> I don't like that either. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm sorry, Your Honor. A fact which is clear if you simply try sounding the clock. Let's sound the clock now, here in this court. 
Your Honor, may I have the clock? Certainly, you seem to have the fingers for it. <laughs> I ask the court to listen very carefully. I think it's 825. That certainly is a strange way to announce the time. <laughs> well, he is the thinker after all. That uh, doesn't make sense. <laughs> so we've heard the clock. What are your conclusions, Mr. Wright? Mr. Payne, can you tell me what time it is right now? Oh, You're Mr. It, Payne. It's 11.25. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> she just turns and looks at me. As you can see, this clock is exactly three hours slow. Precisely the discrepancy between what Mr. Sot heard and the actual time of death. So, Mr. Sot, try to talk your way out of this one. <laughs> you forgot one thing. Uh-oh, what's he talking about? Well, it may seem like that clock is running three hours slow. It proves nothing. As you know, it was running three hours slow the day of the murder. If you can't prove that, you don't have a case! <laughs> Shit! <laughs> He's right! How am I gonna prove that? Damn it! That was so close! Mr. Wright, it seems you lack the critical evidence to support your claim. Uh, yes, Your Honor. Oh, oh great! <laughs> I like it when you just listen to me. <laughs> oh, man. I was worried you were gonna take this whole thing and turn it on its ass or some bullshit. <laughs> All right. This means I cannot let you indict the witness. Unfortunately, this ends a cross-examination of Mr. Frank... Mr. Frank who? <sighs> Mr. Frank the witness. Uh, 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 we have another witness named Frank. Frank saw it! <laughs> I came all the way down here to testify and look what happens. They, they treat me like a criminal, a criminal! Oh, well, you are ugly. You lawyers are all slime. That that suit is criminal, I'll tell you what. <laughs> it's true. That's an ugly shade of fuchsia. It's Girl, terrible shade. I almost had Sorry, Larry. I failed <laughs> Sorry, you. Sorry, Larry, you're gonna be executed. <laughs> 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 oh no, Phoenix. There's nothing I can do about it now. Not so fast, <laughs> Mr. Sight. <laughs> I have not talked for a while, and you'd think I would have helped more. <laughs> Mia, I mean Chief. Yeah, are you serious? You call me Mr. Mia. <laughs> Le Jesus. Listen up, right? Don't throw this one away. Not like this. Think. But Chief, it's over. I can't prove the clock was slow the day of the murder. Nobody can prove that. Ah, uh, well, yes. Yeah. But that doesn't mean you can't still win. Try thinking out of the box. Remember this. Mr. Saw it pulled this story out of his butthole. <laughs> what if you use the same power? <laughs> you can become the greatest lawyer in the history of lawyers. Don't waste time doubting the facts. Assume the clock was three hours slow and think through it. Ask yourself, why was the clock three hours slow? This is actually a terrible way to figure out facts, but that's okay. Okay, this is called induction yeah. instead of deduction. It's actually not a, not a good at all. Uh, it works for Sherlock Holmes. It works for Sherlock Holmes, but for nothing else in science. <laughs> <laughs> figure out the reason and you'll have the proof. Or the made-up proof. Yeah. Right? Right? <laughs> hey, Your Honor, please shut up. <laughs> the, the, the judge hates puns. It has to be his thing. Yeah, this is definitely a thing. <laughs> Can you think of a reason why the clock would be three hours slow? Ah, uh, I think so. Great, because if you said no, the game's over. <laughs> uh, wait! Maybe I can prove it! Oh, good. You must have some evidence somewhere that can prove it, right? You think maybe I would take a look and help out, but no. Find it and let him have it. Well, Mr. Wright, you say the clock was already running slow on the day of the murder. I am slowly becoming Sean Connery. <laughs> Have you found evidence to support this claim? Of course. There's a piece of evidence in the court record that can prove my claim beyond a doubt. <laughs> Tough words. Let's see you pull this one off. Please don't say pull off when you're half naked in my courtroom. <laughs> Let's see this evidence that proves why the clock is running slow. I believe I believe it's a passport, Your Honor. Oh, please. You're shoving that very violently. <laughs> the victim just returned home from bra, uh, bra the day before the murder. What are these speech bubbles coming from? 
As we all know, the time difference between here and Paris is nine hours. Is that, is that floating? Is that is that passport floating in the air? <laughs> Just wave it around. <laughs> when it's 4 p.m. here, it's 1 a.m. the next day there. Oh, gee, uh, hold on. I gotta carry the 10 here. Wait. <laughs> the clock wasn't three hours slow. It was nine hours fast. Okay. If you couldn't prove, prove it was three hours slow, you can't prove it was nine hours. You know hours. what's weird about this? I'm pretty sure in Japan it's a 24-hour system. I think. Uh, well, I've seen the anime, and they they it's, they address they, they... it. It's basically they treat it the same way. They, oh, they do? They, they, okay. Yeah. But they, it's not Paris and Japan. Ah, well, It's yeah. the United States and Japan that of they course. use. Of yeah. course, It's a 14-hour difference. Ah. Which might be part of why it doesn't become a problem. Oh, okay. Because even with a 24-hour clock, with that much different time, you're still always in the single digits. Yeah. Oh, ha, ha, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I th so I think that yes, they do or they do use a 24 hour, but because it's a 14 hour difference between the U.S. and Japan, yeah, it doesn't matter. Interesting. You know yep, what I'm makes sense. Yeah. You know, because it's like <clears throat> it's one o'clock and then dismisses. Yeah. Interesting. <clears throat> the victim had a reset her clock since returning home. All right. You couldn't prove before that. You still can't prove any of this. That's why the time you heard when you struck her dead in your apartment was wrong. I guess it's the idea of why would she turn it back. Proof enough for you, Mr. Sot? Or should I say, Mr. Did It? Okay, you know what? No. <laughs> Let's stop the music. Everybody stop the music. <laughs> uh, I don't. This is. No. You know what? Get out. Everybody. Pack up. Close it up. We're leaving. Everybody close it up. Editor Chan. Editor Chan. Case closed. Close the doors. Guilty. Guilty. <laughs> I, I'm done. I'm absolutely done. <laughs> Foaming at the mouth. What, uh, that man is having a seizure. Someone help him. <laughs> he's he he's is. a doctor. Did that man just... Order, order, I say! This does not indict him in any way. Well. This case has certainly turned out differently than we all expected. First off, no law was done here. <laughs> Second off, that man apparently is indicted because he fell over. <laughs> Um, which is odd. Yes. Apparently we try people like witches. Yes. Put it in water, does it float? Kill it. <laughs> Mr. Payne, your client? He, he, er, he was arrested and has been taken away, your honor. Mr. Payne, that's not your client, actually. You yes, don't have a client. You don't have a that's client. a witness. It's a prosecuting attorney. Mm. Did we even try? <laughs> Do we even can? <laughs> Very well. Mr. Wright, look at my big eyes. I, mm? I am shocked. <laughs> yes, Your Honor. I have to say, I'm impressed. I don't think I've ever seen someone complete a defense so quickly and find the true culprit at the same time. Hey, thank you, Your Honor. Uh, no, I'm just saying I haven't seen it. I'm not <laughs> impressed. I don't care. At this point, this is only a formality, but <clears throat> this court finds the defendant, Mr. Larry Butt. <laughs> oh. Mr. Larry Butts, not guilty. guilty. Um, what? Get get that get that out of here. Who brought the confetti cannons? Uh, get, my, stop it. my favorite cannon is that it's gumshoe. What? Who? <laughs> get, get that out of bailiff. <laughs> get him out of here. And with that, the court is adjourned. Yeah, I said that weird. Adjourned. It turns out that Frank Saw was a common burglar. He posed as a newspaper salesman to check and see when people were out the house. This was never established. That day, what when Larry went to her apartment, the victim wasn't home. After he left, Mr. Sot let himself do his dirty work. Why did he have a key to her house? I don't know. <clears throat> when he was searching her place, the victim returned. Flustered, Mr. Sot grabbed the nearest blunt object he could find. And Maybe. there's no music to this. Maybe. I really thought there used to be sound to this. Maybe it's only in the 3DS version. Oh, yeah, maybe. August 3rd, 2.32 p.m. Oddly specific. Yes. District Court, Defendant Lobby Number 2. Whew, I still can't believe we won. Right? Good job in there. Congratulations. The thanks, Chief. I owe it all to you. You can call me Bucho Sound. <laughs> Not at all, not at all. You fought your own battles in there. Ironically, I will actually help you out more in future cases than I did in this one. After I'm dead. Whoa, spoiler alert. <laughs> it's been a while since I've seen a trial end on such a satisfying note. 
I've never seen a chief looking this happy. <laughs> I haven't known her very long. <laughs> right. If she's this glad, imagine how Larry must feel. My life is over. Larry, you're supposed to be happy. What's wrong now? Oh, Nick. Don't worry about me. I'll be dead and gone soon. Oh, was he Good, a wait, no, I mean bad, 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 bad. <laughs> Larry, you're innocent. The case is closed. That's a different anime, Nick. <laughs> That's about a young boy with glasses. <laughs> and he goes to a hot tub one time and it's embarrassing. <laughs> But, but my Cindy Windy's gone, man. Gone forever. Larry, she was a... Nah, never whoa, mind. Whoa, whoa, Phoenix. Whoa, Phoenix. She was a dumb slut. Whoa, whoa Phoenix, jeez. Listen, this isn't the most sympathetic portrayal of Phoenix. We've no, seen. no, it's not. Congratulate. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> what happened to the chief? <laughs> Congratulations, <laughs> Harry. Harry. Harry Potts. Harry? Yeah, you. I can practically see the headlines now. Harry Potts. <laughs> Innocent. Do you get it? Because Harry Potts. Because you have a hairy ass. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Thanks. I really owe you one. What is this move? It's just his Is this hand. how you get the ladies? Yeah. He's going to see shots and walk. I won't forget this ever! Let's celebrate! Dinner? Movie? My treat! Oh, no, I literally could not. <laughs> because I am... Let's see, you are... 23! <laughs> and I am... Wait, 27? Wait, she's 27? I forgot she was that young. Dang, she's young. I'm the same age as Mia? No, you're 23 right now. No, Sarah. In real life. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Dumb. <laughs> Excuse me. No, 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 you're 23. Oh my god. <laughs> Shut up. Also, I'm older than Phoenix. Yeah, that's upsetting. Yeah, but he's more accomplished than you. I know. That's sad. Oh no, I couldn't. Hey, I was the one who got you off the hook. Well, you want to go to dinner with him? Maybe. He not like he paid me. I'll write this down. I'm gonna write this fanfic. <laughs> it's already existing. Oh, hey! H here, take this! It's a present! A, a present? Did, did someone die with this? Uh, yeah! <laughs> oh, wait, wasn't this the evidence that... Actually, I made this clock for her. I made one for her and one for me! Dang, you're really accomplished! Well, really? You made this? You're... Quite the sculptor, actually. You should, you should like sell these. You should go into art. Yeah, wink, 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 nudge. Wink, nudge. <laughs> well, thank you. I'll, I'll keep it as a memento. <laughs> By the way, you didn't mention if this was the one you had or the bloody one from evidence. You I just said I, you made two. I think it's the one he had. You think it is, but you don't, <laughs> don't know. know that it is. <laughs> Yo, Nick. Can you believe it? I was so into that chick. And and she was just playing me for a fool. Don't that make you just wanna cry, Nick? Don't you just wanna cry? <laughs> um, but, hey, Larry. Larry. Jesus. <laughs> Are you so sure? Hey, squeeze me! <laughs> I said that. This uh This game's amazing. <laughs> I know. It's one of the finest games ever made. <laughs> One of the finest series you can participate it's in. It's true. It is on the 3DS, all three of the original games. Yeah, you go buy it. You go buy it. I think that she thought of you quite a lot in her own way. <laughs> Just... Nah, you don't gotta sympathize with me. Oh, I know the voice I'm doing now. He's one of the three stooges. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, I'm, I'm not sympathizing. <laughs> At all. I don't care. <laughs> Isn't that right, right? <laughs> Aren't you glad that I'm gonna stop doing this? <laughs> Don't you have something to show your friend? Something that proves how she felt about him. Uh, uh -huh. panties. Oh yeah, right. You, you <laughs> 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 oh god, I was guessing. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on, hold on. What was I, the question? No, I'm glad I didn't throw you under the bus there. Well, what the heck is she talking about? I think it's the thinker. Check this out, Larry. Proof positive you weren't just chump some chump to her. Huh? What? Where'd you get that clock? 
<laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I'm an idiot! <laughs> oh no! Look at his face! I can't with that face! <laughs> what are you doing? Come on, Larry! Although I guess the question is, why does he have it? It's supposed to be an evidence. And we know from this game that evidence is supposed to be kept in a locker. I know! Evidence is like true. This is the clock you made for her, Larry! Oh, what happened to her? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's neat. That's neat. I, don't, I didn't make no clock. <laughs> she, she took it with her when she traveled. Hmm, she probably just needed to clock this all. <laughs> I'm very self-deprecating all of a sudden. <laughs> you think so? It's a pretty heavy clock to take traveling. Hmm. Well, well. make of it what you will. Hmm. Hey, Nick! I'm glad I asked you to be my lawyer. Really, I am. Thanks. I mean, I... I can't afford nobody else. <laughs> See, that Grossberg? Dude is expensive. <laughs> Hope that made him feel a little better. <laughs> and getting him off that murder charge. Yeah, exactly. Hope that put a smile on his face. Yeah. Right. I hope you see the importance of evidence <laughs> now. <laughs> Come on! Come on, Phoenix! God, you're an idiot. Come on. <laughs> He's better than this. Also, hopefully you realize things change depending on how you look at them. What? I don't even know what I'm saying. People, too. For instance, if you look at me after I'm dead, <laughs> not as hot. <laughs> till I, till I my hope. Si till my sister channels me. Till my sister channels me, and then I'm like, whoa, Ooh, look at this young skin. Ten out of ten. <laughs> Wearing those clothes that are too small. Yeah. It's hot shit. I don't know why I keep the shoes on. Yeah. Have bigger feet. But we never really know if our clients are guilty <laughs> or innocent. But we will lie the shit off to get them there. <laughs> All we can do is believe in them. And in order to believe in them, you have to believe in yourself. Believe in the me that believes in you, <laughs> oh Phoenix. God. Oh, man. A drill told me that once. <laughs> right. Listen. Learn. Grow strong. What is this? This is like the Hidlin, the Heidelin. <laughs> this is bullshit. <laughs> Listen. Learn. Grow strong. Never let go of what you believe in. Never do it. Don't do it. Why couldn't I say that with the screen <laughs> I know. I don't know. Was I'm still a... here. <laughs> it's not hiding going. Like... In your head? What, what were they? What were they saving money on, like <laughs> data? Maybe actually. Like, uh, no, they were. Uh, no way. They, they couldn't like they, they. The the third game was almost too big, and in fact there was there was a case yeah, in the third game. Yeah, but the third, third game. game is way more sprites. Yeah, but they were like there was a case for the third game. They were gonna put in the second game, but they didn't have enough room for it. Nah, this. this but then there'd be like no cases in the third game. Like two cases. I don't know. Well, I think our work here is done. Shall we be off? I'm not sure if it is. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, very committed. Say, how about dinner on me? Oh, good, because I'm poor as heck. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Oh, yeah, that's fine. I'm going to put on my ace. Oh, nice. You want to eat spaghetti on my ace? <laughs> uh, you want to have my ass spaghetti? Is this, is this sexual uh, in the workplace a good idea? I'll tell you what's a good idea, you little <laughs> slut. Get over here. <laughs> Oh man. I like that spiky hair. Oh man. Run my hands through it. Oh man, oh Don't man. Don't run from me! That's no good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's bad touch time. <laughs> we'll drink a toast to innocent butts. <laughs> <laughs> this game is for four year olds. <laughs> it's awesome. Yeah! Oh, speaking of Harry, <laughs> I gotta get some work done. <laughs> my ass is a forest. <laughs> I need a good old wax, if you know what I'm saying. Oh, no. Get a Brazilian while you're I gotta, I gotta go. A Brazilian? Are you kidding me? I need a sham shit out there. I need a... <laughs> oh, my God. You were saying part of the reason you became a lawyer was because of him. Er, yeah, part at least. It's an incredibly embarrassing story. Yeah. You'll have to tell me more about it sometime. Maybe over drinks, but not dinner, which we are currently going to. <laughs> Am I taking you to dinner and then asking you out on a date <laughs> separately? Am I trying to fuck you or not? I don't know what I want out of this. 
Do I have a dimple in my breast, or is that something on the screen? I can't. Ah, oh, it's on my. I was gonna say that looks too small to be a pixel. Yeah, it's fair. These <laughs> things are huge. Yeah. Big ass pixels. And so my first trial came to a close. Larry slapped me on the back and said, "Gee, Nick, that's good at friends." Ugh. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure he's not gonna pay me unless you count the clock he gave me. Uh. No, I don't. Eh. I didn't know it then. That clock was soon gonna be at the center of another incident. And my promise to tell the chief about me and Larry would be one promise I would be able to keep. Why are you whispering? Uh, I, I thought it was kind of dramatic. Tension. You say I'm gonna die? Uh, what? I can't tell his future. I, what, what are you saying, chief? I, I just, I mean... Get over here, you little ragamuffin. <laughs> Oh no, not again! <laughs> yeah, that's right. The end indeed. Yeah. Oh my god. The end of your innocence. Oh man. Alright, folks. That's. Alright, folks. I had uh, a great time with this. Um, oh, man. Uh, even though both our voices are dead, we, I we, know. If, we, if we were going to do these, we have to just do these for the run of the, of yeah. the session. We'll, our voices will die. Oh my gosh, yeah. I hope you uh, endured with us through our voices. I know the gameplay is not super interesting, but. Uh, it only gets better it's as you build up. Uh, maybe we'll just do a few of our favorite cases. Yeah, yeah. And uh, maybe. maybe if you if you like it. Yeah, let's. If know you like what us, you like. let us know. Yeah, if please not, let us know. Then that's oh, fine. We'll do something, something else. I've got way too much bullshit. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, don't uh, don't play Emily is away. <laughs> play this. <laughs> this is much better. Uh, that's free. Uh, just like all the other pain in the world. <laughs> and like joy, this costs money. <laughs> so. Oh man. But, but they say money can't buy happiness. They're wrong. <laughs> They're absolutely wrong. It's all right. Uh, yeah. See. Oh. Oh. Uh. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Okay. I, I think you have to save the ROM itself, though. I don't think you can actually. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I think. Okay. All right. Bye, guys. All right. See you later. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>